this is, I think, bread and butter of what Kenya is. That <laughs> what politics? Politics. <laughs> it's our national sport. I I suspect, you know, if there was athletics, a, 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 a close second. Athletics comes a close second. We break records with politics. So <laughs> barely mm, a year from After a the general elections. election. All right, that was extremely exhausting. Took us two years before that to suck up to that, and then six we, months, six after months of, of chaos and whatever. We are s- seriously building up another political season that will come maybe two years from now. From now. How brilliant is that as a <laughs> national sport? How do you like that as just as a national sport? It is exhausting to be honest, because I can't, I can't. I can't think, you know, from a business point of view, yeah. how, how we all suffered because of that chaos. Yes. And then now for you to think that you, you are not only going to go through that twice, yeah, mm-hmm. uh, now the seasons will be longer. Maybe now you're looking at three years of elections, man. Yep. Yeah. So the referendum and whatever it creates, and then after that, the fallout, and then the new institutions, and then the next campaign, and what it's just... It's bloody exhausting, man. So politically, what's happening, I suspect, is this, that realignments, we have to have new realignments before 2022. So the referendum first serves a political need. First. As the 2010 one did yes. for, 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 yeah, the yeah, for, for the deputy president, as the 205 did for, for Ray Laudinga. Laudinga. So essentially, it's a political tool, a massive political tool <laughs> for 2022. That is one, obviously. Then the second problem that it tries to solve against a political problem, which is a matter of seats because the the people who essentially have a chance to be president in 2022 realize that this cycle of just having one running mate is a problem it basically hamstrung it locks yeah, out it, every it, other any person you can deal with yes all right as soon as i say marvin is my running mate everyone is like okay yeah whatever man Move but, also, on. but also the i guess the idea where you have uh, is winner takes all yeah, yeah? In that, so there's out nothing in, the in parliament, nothing else for there's everyone. There's nothing else. else, yeah. So there's no leader of opposition per yeah, se yeah. who is, is within a legislative framework, yeah, to actually act. The idea that you ha- people would still be MP and still run for elections were well, like we are recycling leaders forever and ever and ever. Okay. So the magic bullet was you run for elections and then you once lose, you lose, you're out. You're out. You don't have a political office to sort of sustain you. That so doesn't that, work, has it? Yeah, that is what guys were trying to solve. Um, and obviously, it's fallen flat, you know. On I mean, for some guys, honestly, it has worked. I mean, there are some guys who they've not won seats from 2010 or 2012, and now they look like they they're as- the new kids on the block. <laughs> 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 so, so the, the political problem of this referendum is is just that my problem is that it, it it's it's a cost burden to to taxpayers. Big a, one, a big one. Uh, IBC looks or uh, whatever says they need twelve billion. Yeah, and and it will cost more. I suspect maybe Definitely 20, will cost 20 more. to thirty billion to do a referendum. Uh, then put the whole country into a political mood again, you know, um, and then we'll have to do the political fallouts after that. Obviously, this the the, the, the thing about what question it is, and you know whether we are trying to. What questions do you think they will be? Uh, so I think one we have to solve the question of devolution, uh, which has been posed as a problem for the political class. The, there's the feeling that devolution uh, and all these seats that were introduced by this new constitution are taking resources and money away from the government. Now, I've seen numerous people debunk it and say, listen, that is not the problem. The problem is elsewhere. Look elsewhere. But the political class thinks and feels a problem. And I feel there's a merit to that. No, I'm, uh, I'm not sure. For instance, when you, when you look at any other bicameral system, yeah, yeah. when you take the U.S., the sets of laws for the Senate and the sets of laws for the, uh, for the whatever, junior, for the lower house, for yeah. Congress, yeah, yeah. They, they, they are different in that you have six-year runs, you have two-year runs, yes. and then so there is, the Senate was protected by law yeah. Yeah, to actually check uh, the executive, yeah. But in this case, it's just, I guess, uh, a place of retirement, it's like the House of Lords in the UK, where, where it's a peerage issue. You're just uh, put yeah. there to retire once you are old enough. I, I, I think we have to bite the bullet and say in many ways that there are things that we had postulate as a Senate. Uh, there's counties that you had postulate all 47 of them, and 
viable institutions and the things that we had set, set up in our constitution that were aspirational because I suspect our document was more aspirational. Uh, but non practical. We, and, but yeah, we can say some things that have not worked. All right. That for instance, the question of having But is 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 is, uh, is one time enough for you to say that something hasn't worked? No, no, nothing. Uh, of course not. But nothing stops us from changing laws immediately after 2010 and 2011. Changing it. Nothing stops us. All right. My, my so point being, yeah, if you're not going to give something time to work, because how much time? How much time would no, that? No, I would have said at least two terms. Yeah. But this is See, two terms. No, man. We finished two elections. The second term hasn't ended. Oh. We are just. Well, you know, you at are, the you, beginning no, of the second no, you're term. You're not clear about when the term of the end. You know, so you just said two terms because. Uhuru Kenyatta has finished two terms. No, that's just dumb, man. No, listen. Legally, if today anything happens, Uhuru Kenyatta cannot run again. He's done his two terms. Yeah. So it doesn't matter if there's a okay. beginning or the end. At the end of the second term, are you see, happy? See, also dumb. Very dumb. <laughs>